Hey, what's going on, peoples? So, um, a couple days now I've been playing around with this TV. As you can tell in my past few videos, I've been messing with the color space and the temperature and everything like that. Uh, mainly because this TV will be, um, it won't be my main TV anymore. I'm getting a new TV, but actually the TV that um, I already had purchased, turns out it wasn't as good as I expected. So... It, that won't be my main TV anymore, so I have to go searching again. But I kind of do have a specific TV in mind that um turns out to be like I have not much choice of getting another TV but that one. But you guys will, will soon know, pretty soon. But um anyway, the reason why I'm making this video is because uh, I see a couple um, people on YouTube um, using the color temperature. Let me see if I can go through it real quick. The color temperature on the Sony Bravia TVs. And they're using um, Rec 2020 as a color space. So don't mind the settings right here. I was just playing around with it. So let me try to show you what I'm talking about. Um, so... The video options, color space. I see a lot of people move it to um, Rec 2020 or BT 2020, which is for HDR, and it just gives you more color on it on top of the basic color. So, um, for just for shits and giggles, let's just put the color down to um, let's put the color down to normal default, which is 50. So you guys can see what I'm trying to show you. So um, right now, color is at 50. Do keep in mind, though, my TV was calibrated, so this might be different on a non-calibrated TV. But for my TV, this is what pops up. So color right now is at um, color right now is at 50, which is default. And um, let's see what happened when I put it on BT 2020 to the red. Seems like this TV has a lot of red. The red is really hot on this TV. So um let's show you if you if hope YouTube can really show you guys what happens to the red when you put it on BT2020. So color space is auto right now, which is Rec 709. As you can tell, it doesn't change. So let's see what happens when you go up. Uh the Adobe RGB kind of change the shade of the color it's less um vibrant remember the color is at 50 which is default so now let's go to bt 2020 and see what happens to the um the umbrellas pay close attention to the umbrellas as you can tell right there everything is just flat color there's no there's no shades it's just straight red let's go back to this which which dims the color and the DCI and the Rec 709. As you can tell, not much different when it comes to these. But when you put it on the BT 2020, it's just too red. So um, let's see what happens when I use my regular um, my regular color. Let me put this back on. Yeah, let me keep it on BT 20, and let me show you what happens when I use my regular color, which is 65. Calibrated my top um my limit to my TV is 62. But I usually put it just a tad bit high, which is 65. That's my main color, and I'm some apparent reason I'm going. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. So let's go to 65. As you can tell, it's completely completely red now. Like there's like you can't see anything. There's no lines in the pillow. I mean, no lines in the umbrella at all. So red is really too hot. So let's see what we can do to um to negate this problem that we have with this TV so far with the red. Honestly, I don't think there's anything I can do. Let's lower the color. Get your settings. You tell what happened when you're at 50, which is default. Again, this is a calibrated TV, so I'm not sure it might differ from you guys. 
but this is at 50 so let's go down to below default and see when we start getting shades now we start getting shades but this the is this very dull so honestly people are saying use bt2020 on rec 709 content i don't suggest you do that just for um just for the plain fact that shades of of red is just too much on this tv let's see what happens when i turn off live color because i always have live color on let's see if that makes a difference and i'm not seeing a difference in color so i guess the rec 2020 automatically gives it live color which is the quantum dots for the sony tvs so um yeah honestly i wouldn't turn on um the color space to bt20 2020 because it's just the reds are just too blinding not blinding in a good way but blinding in a, a flat matte surface no no shades so honestly just keep it at the auto which is rec 709 as you can tell right there and you still see shades so let's just go to um matter of fact let me um see what happens when i put it down to 50 on on rec 709 and see what happens let me go back into it let me go back to it oh it's at 50 color so all right let's go up to my regular 62 and see what happened if you see any color change all right so right there i said like 62 is my limit you still see shades of color with a little bit more pop but i usually put it at 65 just to punch it up a little bit more on this tv on this screen on the camera you guys not seeing the shades but there is still shades present as you can see when i put it on 62. Uh, 50 is a little bit too dim for me it might be more accurate but I don't really like it that that dullish looking color. So I keep mine at 65. 62 is for Calibre TV, 62 is my um is my limit. So yeah, that's that's basically it. Like if you want to use Rec 2020 on 709 content, I wouldn't suggest it. So that's it. I just want to show you guys that. If you guys are interested in one to put that feature on regular content, I wouldn't do it. So let me go ahead and show you this video with my settings that I'm going to imply right now. One second. Yeah, so this is a wonderful video of what I'm showing you the demo. You'll see it pretty soon of the, um, the umbrella scene. As you can tell with these settings, without using the, the BT2020, how beautiful this TV looks. So again, this is a calibrated TV. I'm not sure how it looks on a non-calibrated TV. Maybe the red doesn't really it does exaggerate like that on a non-calibrated TV, but for some apparent reason on my TV, the red is way too hot. And it is calibrated, so that that could be the issue. Might be different for you guys. But let me know in the comments if you guys have a different a different um result so that's it hope you guys take care be well and catch you on the flip side